Okay, you score the game winner in game six. You score the game winner in game seven. Tied the series. The series is tied, all tied up. Game eight coming up. If the game had have ended in a 5-5 tie, which it was late in the game, the Russians were going to claim victory because they had scored more goals. Were you aware of that at the time? I was very aware of it. Uh, they told us that. And and, and, and here's uh, our line was out in the ice, Clarkie, Ellis, and I, and we came off with about a minute left in the game. And uh, Harry sent out Esposito, Cornway, and Peter Mohavlich. He started taking over from Frank, playing in that line. And uh, so, but then he, uh, uh, Simon come down and he looked at us and he said, you guys, if they come off, you guys are up. You finish it off. So we knew we were up. And we're sitting on the bench. And Joe, I, I, I can't even explain it to this day. About the one minute mark, I, I, I got to get on the ice. We got to win this game. <laughs> we can lose this game. And I did something, Joe, I never did before. I never did it again. I started yelling at Peter Mohavich, the left winger, to come off the ice. Can, now, can you imagine I do that? Peter comes off and, and the Russians go down and score. I see, I'd be living in Siberia today, but there's, <laughs> you know, there's risk rewards in life. And, and it, it was just, I have to get on the ice. And the other thing, Joe, when I scored that goal and we get back to the bench, Harry said, he said to us, you guys finish it off. And I said, Harry, I can't do it. I am done. I would be petrified to play the last 34 seconds. You put somebody else out there. I am done. And I was, I, I knew, I, w I was petrified to play that. Can you believe that? I just scored that goal. And I didn't want to play the last, I knew myself. And I, I would say to you, after we got back into our dressing room, we weren't jumping around. We were just sitting back in our chairs, having a beer. And it was probably half an hour before I took my skates off. We were just utterly, physically, emotionally drained. 